Hello and welcome to this video in which uh, we speak about a key aspect for your preparation for job interviews at the top strategy consulting firms, McKinsey, Bain and BCG, also known as MBB. So if you are an aspiring consultant, um, you'll want to pay close attention because um, what I'm speaking about now is absolutely essential for MBB interview success. So for MBB, the purpose of the interview is not to test your knowledge or your memory. The interview is an opportunity for the interviewer to evaluate whether you would make a great addition to the firm. The interviewer's most critical question is essentially whether you are what can be called a client-ready problem solver. A client-ready problem solver. So, what does this mean? <laughs> right? Let's say you're a consultant and a client approaches you with a problem. The client says, I'm having trouble with, let's say, my service quality, right? So customer complaints are skyrocketing. I need help figuring out what's going wrong. So in this scenario, your job as a consultant is to solve the problem in a client-friendly manner. The client needs to understand what you're doing to get to the core of the issue and why you're doing it. This is the essence of your job as an MBB consultant, solving problems in a client-friendly manner. Now, if we translate this to a job interview situation at a firm like McKinsey, for example, you will have the chance to showcase your analytical abilities through various case analyses. However, just having analytical brilliance is by far not enough. You also must be able to take others along with your thought process. So the interview will assume that the way you behave in the interview is exactly the way how you would also behave in a client setting. So it is absolutely vital to internalize the importance of client friendliness. And this means taking the client, or in this situation, the interviewer, um, along on every step of your analytical journey. For example, let's say you are analyzing a case and you've come up with an initial structure to approach the problem. Before you present it, you must align with the interviewer on the what, the why, and the how of your analysis. So there must be complete alignment on what is the actual core question we are seeking to answer, why we are answering it, so which objective are we catering for, and how will we invariably arrive at the answer eventually. This way, you can use the interviewer as an ally and as a discussion partner, and you can then benefit from their guidance. When you are presenting your analysis, be clear and easy to follow regarding your logic, the case-solving process, and your calculation steps. Most importantly, do not exclude the interviewer from your thought process. Remember, the interviewer is there to help you. And the goal is to show that you are a client-ready problem solver. And here is one last hint. <laughs> Be linear in your approach. So, A leads to B. B leads to C. And so on. Jumping around from one step to another, like A, uh, then to F, and then back to B, and then to Z, and to K, and to G, etc. This is a cardinal sin in consulting. Right? Some people think this is creativity. No. This is something that no consulting firm can use, right? Because it is the absolute opposite of what you would call client friendliness. So treating your interviewer as a client and being clear and easy to follow 
will keep them on board and increase your chances of success at MBB enormously. Do not treat them like an examiner and do not exclude them from your thought process. Instead, take the interviewer on a clear and easy to follow journey through your analysis.